Guys, this is Effective Kill, back for me, myself, and I, Rage, uh, part 3, I believe. Uh, in the last part, we finished a couple more side quests for those people over there. But we are heading back to Hagen, uh, to hopefully get our buggy and figure out how I can change around my armor. Because I was promised, with my anarchy adjustment, the Crimson Elite Armor. And I'm kind of looking forward to that, and yeah. Also, I'm hoping maybe I can customize my person actually with someone like me. Then I blow his brains out and kill everyone else here. Life in the settlement has never been easy, but Dan keeps us together. His instincts about who to trust have always been right. <coughs> you want to give it another go? Sorry, I'm just looking at your cleavage. I'm a pervert. <laughs> Not that bad looking of a computer generated character. I'm surprised she could keep that kind of figure, especially hey, in the wasteland. Hey, Alex, heck. You? I've got one word for you to remember. <coughs> Feltrite. You know what Feltrite is? Probably not. Well, let me tell you. Feltrite was inside that asteroid that darn near wiped out the whole planet. What it left behind? That is interesting. Feltrite. War from outer space. Powerful stuff. Get your hands on it and keep it. Only traded for something really good. Okay. Is that it? Okay. Day six marking no type thing. You give me all your money. Hey buddy, hey, buddy. Dancing, Dancing you're taking that, taking that old buggy off, off my hands. Hand. <laughs> <Sure, laughs> it is not a bad, not bad vehicle, 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 but, but see, it see, needs, it needs work, work parts. parts. The work I, I can do. Parts, the parts you're gonna need to get. Seriously, back at the outer settlement, you're settlement you're able, to able to help. Sound good? Okay, see you back here. See you back here when you get the parts. So I'm still stuck with taking the shit, uh, the shit buggy. Still don't get my fucking vehicle. I was promised a buggy. I was promised the road, the rat rod buggy, which unless that's multiplayer, if it's multiplayer, that kind of sucks. Because I'm not really probably going to do much multiplayer for this game. I kinda don't even see the pure use of putting multiplayer in this game that's racing. <coughs> Maybe another player, but racing just seems a little stupid. Like there's probably gonna be a thing that I it depends, like like when you look at Fallout, Fallout franchise is based around choice though. Well, well, right. Uh you wanna talk? Oh so, dear, dear need, need some parts for that buggy. Man, he should just junk it. Now I'd like, now I'd like to give But I need you to do my stuff. Freight bandits raided my garage not too long ago and ran off with most of the spare parts. You're gonna need to go down to the hideout near the old dam. Perfect, I know what that place was. If you can handle this, yeah, it's easy. That boys. <clears throat> no, it'll be easy. So far, this game hasn't been too hard except for mutants. Anyway, I'm outside. Pep boys are much stronger than blah blah blah. Just <clears throat> Oh, switching ammo and switching weapons seems to be easy as long as it's an app. I'm actually curious to see how much damage the fat boy does. Hmm. 
Oh yeah, wipe that all the people here. Shit. Are you alive? Makes no sense. <laughs> but it is a pistol. But even a headshot with a pistol is gonna wipe you out. Yeah, I fucking unloaded on your ass. Give me all your ammo. Locals only. Blah blah blah. Shut up. No coach only. That texture didn't load. Still not used to Y being the jump button. I'm used to A. Well, that kind of distracted. <coughs> so keeping the wing sticks. Because I like them. They're kind of cool. I knew I'd have to go here. Yeah, you guys saw that I went here. And I said, I know I'm going to have to go here. Don't be afraid to get your hands dirty. Melee attacks can save your life and, rip and beat your wife. Dirt, dirt, dirt. Well, the guy kind of looks like a redneck. Don't judge me. I'd never do that. Yeah. Uh, Hardware packets, probably all shit. <coughs> What's this? Lock grinders. Let's make a lock grinder. Is this supposed to be like one? Huh? So that's the purpose of it. You get back here. Shit. Well, that buckshot shotgun works wonders. Stay down. <clears throat> I can take you on one at a time. A lot of dead guys over here. I'm God. I'm God, motherfucker. You think you can take me out? I can't die. Ouch. Shit. 
shotgun is shit. <clears throat> Asshole. bad thing about when I play. I keep quiet. I'd be taking this a lot more seriously if I was on a tough difficulty, but I'm not, so not really taking this seriously. Made me break my wing stick, you asshole. I don't like that. They are not really bright. I thought the AI would be a little smarter. Shit. Antiseptic formula. Here we go with that. Uh, I don't know, it could be that I'm just tired and I'm not analyzing it. But, no, yeah, I need a grinder. I can build one! <laughs> Something in here. Steel blades. Antiseptic formula. Bombs. To do, to do, to do. Just cleaning house over here. <laughs> Stay down. <laughs> you both dead? There's another person over here. Where'd he go? Ooh, can set. Ooh, ooh. When you think about it, ooh, like that. That has got to be a delicacy nowadays in this age. Because. Yeah. Is when you look about it. <clears throat> this is set in the future where. You got hit. Yeah, it's gonna take humanity a couple, maybe a thousand years to get back to what we were. Wasted pistol. <laughs> oh shit. I messed that up. <laughs> Take that wing stick. Shit. You know, I was actually watching a movie last night. Shit. It was by the name of it's called uh, The Invention of Lock, and I actually kind of like the movie. Um, I can't remember, I don't really know actors' names, or they play roles. I find out later, and most of the time I'm kind of stumbling over who they are. Uh, the 
cut you to blue ribbons. Oh shit! <laughs> ah shit! Is that all they're gonna do? Yeah, this is the anti-human one. Choice. Close range, very deadly. Oh shit. Ah! Oh. I do not wish that on any man. <laughs> Being burned a lot. That's... <laughs> That's funny. I get stuck in their head. I am bleeding heavily now. Look, chop that guy's fucking head off right there. So do I just single-handedly what? What about all of these places? All of these people? I wipe them out? That's pathetic. When you think about it. So these are junkers, when you think about it. People that steal parts. Shit! waste ammo and I can just retrieve them most of the time if they die. <laughs> this guy is a fucking idiot. <laughs> he just yelled at me and that's all he did. Pretty sure you can get behind him and fucking just rape his ass right there. And I can't like rip anything off his body. Kinda suck. Look at this. I don't even know if this is supposed to render when you look at it. It's not even rendered. It's showing in the recording. This didn't render. Sucks. There we go, there's all the parts. Waste management. What the hell? Oh, shit. Oh, but no, 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 no. Ah, fuck. Okay, you're fucking dead. You're fucking dead for breaking my wind stick, you asshole. <clears throat> These aren't like Fallout. They're not like random wastes that you can just explore. No, the game is always an extreme linear path from what I've noticed. A little boy, but what do you expect? It's, it's an id title. Yeah, a lot of their games weren't tending to be uh, going off the beaten path when you look at it. Heck, their last game was Doom 3, and that was pretty much just a linear get from point A to point B over and over again. And Get the fuck away from my buggy, you assholes. Jesus Christ. Ooh! They made it badass looking. I don't even think that was my buggy. Whatever, I'm taking their buggy. In my new buggy, it's the improved buggy. Whatever. I'm taking this thing. I 
I maybe could have hit that, but I'm kind of doubting it. I have the accuracy to really hit that mark. Okay. Okay, we are pretty much out of time in this video. So I will catch you guys up in the next video, part 4.